Beep, boop, 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 boop. We all got back to live, let's play it. I don't know what I'm doing there. Welcome back, guys. Just messing around with the, the light on the helmet. It's a lot of fun. Continuing on exploring this lifeless planet. That's not so lifeless. Last time we found out what happened to the wife. She fell off a cliff. She got clumsy. Careless. That's a lot of blood. I hope she's still alive. The creature has the woman now. And she's clearly been injured. Drops of the woman's blood grow bright green on the cavern floor. I hope she's still alive, but I can't imagine how I'll be able to help her if that monster is nearby. I'm sure it'll be fine. Plus, the woman has a name. You could call her by her name. It's Alita. We figured that out already. But if you want to call her woman, that's I guess that's your, your prerogative. Abyss. Oh, good. Oh, good. A dark abyss with, with things that are probably going to freak out and try and kill me. Please don't kill me. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate you letting me pass. I come in peace. Man, she's got a lot of blood. It really doesn't seem possible that she's bleeding this much and still alive. I don't think there's gonna be anything left of her when we find her. She goes, hey, you're all right. What are you doing out there? Do you need assistance? It looks like she's bowing to the creature. Meditating or something. I'm gonna slam these rocks together. Oh, oh no! I'm sorry! Is it, am I not supposed to be doing this? Or, or. Don't die on me, girl. I'm coming to rescue you. like a bad idea. Are you sure you want to do that? Are you, uh oh. Oh god. I think we just got led into a trap. I am Groot. That was crazy. It was an I Am Groot moment. Have you seen, have you guys seen Guardians of the Galaxy? If you haven't seen it, you should go watch it. I've seen it twice already. I'm going a third time this weekend. It's one of the best movies I've ever seen. It's fantastic. The Green Lands. She saved my life. The woman I've been following is gone. Well, no, she's still here, all around me, having given herself up to the monster to save this planet. She willingly shared her life, her life-saving cure, at her own expense. I'd like to think she's more at home here, merged with this strange and beautiful ecosystem, than in the company of a lowly human being such as myself. Whatever the case, she saved my life along with countless other beings on this planet. So she sacrificed herself to tame the monster. And 
now we can't go out on our steak dinner. Be together forever. Oh, this is trippy. This is really trippy running across this thing while it's all moving. Oh god, I don't want to die. It's just really hard to do. It's hard to navigate. Uh, it's like... It's moving, but not moving. It's so crazy. I think we'll just go this way. That seems like a bad idea now that I did it. Do we want to go down there? Probably not. Can I get back up here? Come on. Come on, let me back up there. I think I went the wrong way. There we go. The music's getting crazy. All right, I know. I went the wrong way. I get it, music. All right, I'm going the right way now, I think. This is kind of making me ill. Making me a little nauseous. Everything's moving. I'm not keen on heights. Am I even remotely going the right way or am I just going in circles and stuff? Like I can't I can't tell anymore. Great, now I've got myself lost. Okay, we need to get over there. Okay. Is that the one we I think we want to be on this one. Oh man. Oh god. It's so crazy. I feel like I shouldn't be able to run on it. Like I'm gonna fall off at any moment and just die. I think, I think this is it. Maybe? Is this where I'm supposed to be? Ah! I think we gotta go over there, but it's... I'm not gonna, like, die or anything, am I? I'm trying to, you know, like, face plant into a rock like before. There we go. Oh, it's a perfect landing. Didn't go splat. That's a relief. Whoa, that was a brief sharp cut off. Okay, gotta warn me there. It kinda hurt. It like popped in my headphones. I don't know if it popped for you guys. Could he could he use the fade out there on the audio? Or it could have just kept going. I would have been fine with the music. Just continuing to go. I was enjoying it. It was a bit loud, but it's all right. The ground kind of looks like spider webby. It's probably not a good thing. What's happening? Why is the music kicking in? Are those geysers like spreading seeds of life? It seems like that would be a good thing, but the music's telling me otherwise. I don't know if I want to step on that. That kind of looks like a bad puddle. Could just be a shadow. It's probably just a shadow.
Well, let's go up here and let's check it out. Come on. No, no, don't fall down. Oh, God! Oh, come on! Ow. What? Give me a break. Now we're all the way back here. What was that? It was like I stubbed my toe and then I died. I barely even fell. I'm just going to check if there's anything over here. Just to see. Nothing? Alright. No coffee or anything back there. We'll just keep going. Back through the tangly brush. Tripping on acid. All right, so I'm guessing we got to jump across all these rocks. Rather than try and scale the side of that mountain. Right over the rock. Let's try that again. There we go. Beautiful. Get up there now. Come on. You can make the really hard jump and then just completely fail at the, the easy one. Whew, that was close. Last one. Well, almost. There we go. Woohoo! See a satellite dish. What does it mean? It feels urgent though. Whatever it is. This music's making me feel like I gotta hurry. <laughs> gotta hurry. Music's getting kind of patriotic again. So the other portal does lead back to Earth, but hundreds of years in the future. The portal to this planet was a one-way transport mechanism, as we discovered following our initial arrival. We originally assumed... I gotta use the Russian accent. We originally assumed it would work like any doorway, that we could return through the same portal device at our convenience. But this was not the case. Thankfully, we eventually discovered the second portal, the departure portal, leading back home. This two-portal system was actually very efficient for our transport purposes. And we developed our settlements appropriately to regulate travel back and forth as necessary. But we did not comprehend at first was the loss time encountered through portals. While transport happens quickly, time on Earth and and on this planet are not in sync. We soon realized a week on this world was a month back on Earth. When the portals failed, this time disparity became great. When the arrival portal malfunctioned and killed so many people, we became afraid to use the departure portal to return to Earth. Over time, we started to see images we did not recognize on the other side. There were strange, towering structures, much more advanced than anything we'd seen before. Some believe the portal had recalibrated to the homeworld of the portal creators, but I knew the truth. The images in the portal were of Earth, but centuries in the future. Unfortunately, we never tested our hypothesis given the completely unstable power reactions from the portal. It was far more likely we would suffer a tragic transportation accident like our comrades. 
from home attempting to reach us. There were no volunteers, and eventually no further opportunities before the portal went dark and cold. In retrospect, I'd wish we'd taken our chances. So, there is another portal. We can get back to Earth, but it's going to be... It's going to be kind of quite a trip. Open up. Open up. Open up. Kind of looks like I could I could maybe send a message. I could play some play some tunes or something. Get this world jumping and jiving. It's not going to open up. Must press on. Continue running. Jetpack. I'd rather jetpack. It's getting intense. What lies over the mountain? <gasps> there it is! The portal! We're going home! There's the monster. You can't stop me. I'm going home. Could be it, guys. We might make it off this lifeless planet. Farewell. It's been real. I'm out of this joint. So close. We're gonna do this. We're doing it. We're going back to Earth. Mama, I'm coming home. Understand, you've kept your wife on life support. It sounds like you haven't been able to let her go. Actually, I did it for her. I want to give her every chance to live again, even if I'm not here. Did we do it? Are we home? It home. We made it back to Earth. Music by Rich Douglas. Rich, your music rules. I love the soundtrack for this game. It was perfect. Well, guys, what do you think? Is she still alive? I think she's still alive. He kept her on life support, and I bet you they found a way to, to bring her back. probably still alive I didn't run across that lifeless plan for nothing all right she's still alive if we get to the end of these credits and it tells me she's dead or something like that 
I'm gonna be so mad. If it tells us anything at all, it probably it might not say anything. Thanks, Shep McAllister, for supporting this game. Kenick, Ekar, Alex Glenn. Zachary Edwards. You have two names. Space Pilot. That's not a name. Hosh Kicker. Axel. Trying to see if there's any crazy names in here. I wonder if people had crazy names, but they wouldn't let them put them in the game. Stink. What will you miss most about Earth? Well, my wife, first of all, and then Earth itself. All of it. She saw the beauty of this planet long before I did. You truly loved her. Of course. And if you lose someone you love, even 20 light years probably isn't enough distance to make you stop missing them. Aww. That was a nice touching moment. Elita misses us. She's gonna send us a message. I think that's what that meant anyways. What do you guys think? Well, I think that's gonna do it then for Lifeless Planet. That's it for this playthrough. We beat another game. Finally! It's only been like a year. It only took us like a year to get through another game, guys. I'm really excited. I had a lot of fun playing this. I hope you guys had a lot of fun watching it. It was a blast. And what do you guys want me to play next? What, what other games would you like to see? I've got some ideas. I've got some games, uh, lots of games on my Steam list that I want to play through. But uh, what kind of games do you want to see? I, I, I would like to play more games like this because it, it had that Alan Wake vibe to it. It was a little creepy. There was uh, an interesting narrative going on. A story that you kind of had to figure out while you were playing it. And... Um, not, none of my predictions became true, so I guess kudos to them for that because then it's it, you know it wasn't too predictable. I figured that it was going to be Earth all along, and I saw some people thinking that that was going to be his wife, like she left as an astronaut and then came here, and and we were chasing after her the whole time. That didn't turn out to be the case crazy what did you guys think leave me some comments let's talk about it and i hope you join me for the next game i play until then take care